Eagle Landing Residence Hall is the only hall on campus with kitchens in the suite. Known for having more fire alarms. Lately, there have been more fire alarms than anything else happening in Eagle Landing. There have been um, a lot of fire alarms this year. Um, last year, we usually had about maybe three or four a month, but now we total them about 10. In the last three weeks, there have been fire alarms every few days at various times, including four and five o'clock in the morning. Being an RA doing a fire alarm can be very tiring because you have to start whatever you're doing, even if you're sleeping at five in the morning and get up and go downstairs and make sure residents are leaving the building. A most common cause for causing the alarm to go off is residents simply forgetting that they were cooking. There are a few precautions to take when cooking to prevent a fire alarm. Because I take the necessary precautions um, to not set the fire alarm and that's opening your door, cutting on the fan, um, opening your window, just different things like that to not set off the fire alarm. Residents are also trying to cut back down on the amount of fire alarms. Look, this is my second year living in Eagle Landing and the fire alarms, I've always known that Eagle Landing fire alarms go off um, for a very long time. In the past maybe two weeks or so, they've been coming every few days. Well, when I cook, I turn the fan on. I don't let my flat irons and things like that um, heat up to the point where smoke is coming out of them. It is expected that the fire alarm will go off. In general, Eagle Landing is known for its fire alarms going off. Regardless, it is expected that the fire alarm will go off.